could assume the answer is zero dollars, but the truth is totally different. This one's tricky because it looks like basic arithmetic, just a few twos and some minus signs, right? The expression is two minus two times two minus two. And almost everyone does this. They go, okay, two minus two is zero, minus two is negative two, times two is zero. Boom, zero dollars. But that's exactly where everyone falls into the trap. Let's slow it down because this one's all about order of operations, the same kind of rule following that separates good math from bad investments. You might have heard of PEMDAS, which stands for parentheses, exponents, multiplication, division, addition, and subtraction. And here's the golden rule. Multiplication and division always come before addition and subtraction moving left to right. So let's apply that properly. The original expression is two minus two times two minus two. There are no parentheses or exponents, so we start with the multiplication. That's two times two, which equals four. Now rewrite the expression. It becomes two minus four minus two. From here, go left to right. Two minus four gives negative two, then negative two minus two gives negative four. So the correct answer is negative four not zero dollars. It's such a small difference, just like in finance, where missing one tiny step can turn profit into loss. A misplaced minus sign or ignoring the sequence and the whole outcome flips. So next time you face something like this, remember, math isn't just numbers, 